Hey, curious minds, have you ever wondered why lemon tastes sour or why soap feels slippery? Today, I am diving into the wacky world of acids, bases and salts and showing you how a simple litmus test can reveal their secrets. So, what are acids and bases? Acids are usually sour, think lemons and vinegar. Bases are bitter and slippery, like soap or baking soda. And salts? They are not just the stuff you sprinkle on fries. Salts are what you get when acids and bases mix together. Here's the cool part. Scientists uh, use um, something called an indicator to tell them if something's an acid or a base. The most famous one, litmus paper. It's like a magic strip. Dip blue litmus paper in an acid and it turns red. Dip red litmus paper in a base and it turns blue. Super easy. Let's try a few examples. Lemon juice, acid. Turns blue litmus paper red. Soap, that's a base. It'll turn red litmus paper blue. Table salt in water, neither acid nor base. The litmus paper stays the same. Now, here's something extra fun. Scientists have a special ruler called the pH scale. It's a number line from 0 to 14 that tells us how acidic or basic something is. If something has a low pH, like 1 or 2, it's super acidic, just like lemon juice. If it has a high pH, like 12 or 13, it's really basic, like soap. And right in the middle at 7 is neutral, that's plain water. So in general, if the pH is less than 7, it's acidic. And if pH is more than 7, it's basic. So next time you see a lemon, soap, or even some salt, you'll know there's a whole science party happening at the tiniest level. Try the litmus test with adult supervision and see what surprises you can uncover. Stay curious, keep exploring, and remember, science is everywhere.